Today we're going to be drawing the SpaceX Falcon Heavy rocket. It's going to look somewhat like this. So at the top of the rocket, towards the top of your paper, it has the part where the load is going to be carried. And it kind of rounds off at the top and then it comes down and it gets straight on the sides like this. And then it comes in a little bit on both sides. Then it's going to come straight across like this. Make that a little bit darker so you can see it a little bit better. I'm going to color over that one more time. Just rounds up at the top, comes in a little bit, and then straight across. That's going to be the top of the rocket. That's where the Tesla was held whenever it was launched into outer space towards Mars. Okay, then it's going to come straight down. And it's a pretty long rocket. Then it's going to close off at the bottom. It's going to have little boosters here at the bottom of it that's going to come out just a little bit, then across. Then it has two more rockets on either side. They're a little bit smaller and a little bit skinnier. And they also have little dome tops. The dome tops aren't quite as big. They just kind of round off like this and then straight down from that dome top. And they're made to detach from the ro main rocket and come back to Earth. So they're a little bit smaller and they aren't completely attached to the main rocket. They're only attached by these posts that are keeping it together. So we're gonna draw those posts right now and then it's gonna come in. And then it's gonna come on both sides. We're going to draw another rocket that looks just like that one on the other side. It also has a little booster at the bottom. It also has these little posts that are going to attach it. At the bottom of each of these rockets, it has a V shape. And then on this rocket, we're going to write SpaceX. So space is S, P, and they're just going underneath one another. A, C, E. So you spell space, S, P, A, C, E, and then X called the SpaceX Falcon Heavy Rocket. Now we're gonna have fire coming out of it, which is kind of like, it's, it's a white fire, but we're gonna make it more yellowish. It's cause it is kind of a yellowish white fire. And so it's just gonna kind of come down and fan out like this. 
And then you're gonna kind of just make a C shape. So kind of like the letter C. And then it's gonna S around here and another little C shape like this. We're gonna do the same thing on the other side. It's gonna have kind of a C shape and then just kind of come around like that. Now there's gonna be rockets coming out of, or fire coming out of all three of these rockets. So we're gonna do the same thing on each one, except for once they touch, we'll just leave it like that. And then on the outside of the rocket flames, I'll show you what to do in just a second. I'm gonna go ahead and get these to where they're touching. So on the outside of it, we're gonna have the smoke, like it's launching off the launch pad and it's filling the launch pad with smoke. So I'm just gonna, it's almost like a cloud. It has these big bubble swooping hump shapes that come like this. Like that. Then, up at the top, we're gonna draw some clouds that have just these thin um, clouds that are kind of bumpy with humps. Then when we're finished, it can look like this. Now the real space rocket is just white. Um, I colored mine gray and with black Vs. Um, and the real flames coming out are almost white too. They're kind of a yellowish white. But I colored mine with red and yellow. And so it kind of adds some color to it. 